Uh, gotta say guys, this, this game really does put you on the edge of your seat. I'd probably say more so than Resident Evil 2 Remake. Um, I am really enjoying this and uh, the, the tension in it is just absolutely amazing. Anyway, this is part 7. Hope you enjoy it guys. Thumbs up if you do. Let's do this. Hello guys, so welcome back. We are on the wrecked ship and uh, we just watched a scary video. Um, now, I don't know why, but the uh, in the video we was inundated with weapons pretty much and now we've got a handgun with no bullets. So there's we're not going to be doing a lot of damage. Um, yeah, so let's have a look at, we need to look for Ethan, that's our current objective. And uh, yeah, let's see. Let's see where we go. We're gonna need to avoid all contact, basically, because we can't do anything. We can't. We've got no knife, no gun. But zilch. Okay. That looks like where we're supposed to be going. What's this? Okay, that's helpful. Contents have been taken. Destroy something. Something must first be set before you do this. Place in a sample. I can't quite make that out. Like I said, if we see something, we're going to sprint and run and hide. Because, uh, oh! Hang on a minute, what? Oh, we need a lockpick, I guess. Come on, show me some love. I need some bullets, man. Broken. Okay. I can hear Sank squelching. We don't have any of that liquid. We can't get through there. Okay, looks like we're gonna have to try and pry open the lift doors. There's definitely nothing else, is there? No. Okay. All right, this is looks like what we're going to be doing. Please don't kill me. Now we can go up, or we can get in the uh, in the lift. Oh no, we can't get in the lift. <laughs> okay, well that's that's that. Then we're going up. It's a long way up. Okay, before we do that, just want to have a little look around. Oh, look at that, look! It looks like he was um, completing like a, an assault through the window and he's got caught by that thing. A remote bomb. Is that similar to what we had? Oh, I see. So, do you remember in the last video we 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 done the um, we went through the actual videotape and we played we played uh, Mia at an earlier time. I wasn't sure how to use the bombs. 
But that, I was trying to throw them, but it, it, yeah, it looks like you just put it down on the floor, which is pretty cool. I quite like that. Come on, drawers, give me ammo. Nothing. Gunpowder. That's really creepy, that is. It's very dark, I can't see a great deal. Okay, so let's, uh, let's just check back here before we start pushing computer buttons. Okay, let's let's do the computer. I didn't realise this area was quite large. Um, let's have a look. Yeah. Okay. We'll, we'll we'll do the computer and then we go to the was it Captain's Cause? That one there. Maybe it still works. Oh, bit of luck in it. Change camera. Okay, that's the uh, that's the TV video area where we watch the video. That's the lift shaft. Not sure where that is. Oh, Ethan. that's Ethan. Yeah, where is that? I hope I make it in time. Okay, bottom level. S two. Okay, so this. Oh shit! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Oh man, this little girl. I hope we get to kill her. Oh, I tell you what, I, I jumped back on my chair about two foot. Oh, God. Oh, man. You've got nothing to open it with. Oh, it's a machine gun. Okay, we got to get this open. Okay, so we've got a map. We've got a lug wrench. Come on, where's the key? Must be a key in here. A poxy gun with no bullets. All right. Mm. Okay. Let's, uh, let's keep exploring, guys, because I don't think it's in there. Now, I'm not quite sure what the point of that is, because we can't, if we can't fall from there, we'll die. Okay, something tells me Something bad is going to happen soon because it keeps loading us up with health. Um, so this should be interesting. Now we know that. Okay, that's just taking us around, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Okay, there must be a key in here. We're, we're obviously missing it. I suppose it could be in another room. We definitely don't have a key of any kind. I wonder if we can make any bullets, actually. Uh, hang. Oh, we can! Oh, sweet! Oh, I feel so much better now. Okay. Just checking those drawers there in case I'd missed a uh, missed something. I've just realised we are going to have to fall through this. Oh, hang on, what's this out here? 
At least that looked good. Is that a bomb? We are going to have to fall down. This is going to hurt though. We can't get back up there, so... Oh, okay, let's do it. Oh. Oh shit, we... Oh, hang on, we can use that, can't we? That'll do it. Nice. Oh, hang on. What's this level? Oh, I know where we are. Yep, yeah, okay. Must be Baron's there for a second. Oh shit, I can hear something. Hey! Oh, what we got here? The cable's completely fried. We had replacement. The cable's completely fried. We had a replacement. But we had to use it to fix something in the 3F sick bay. You're going to have to go to ask Dr. Waddle for it. I'm needed down in number two engine room, but I can't get down there unless we get this thing working. Dwayne. Okay. Uh, so it's missing a fuse. Okay, so it looks like we need a cable and a fuse to get the lift working. And, uh, yeah, okay. Uh, this is going to be rough. Let's climb up. Oh, shit! Run! Close the door. Close it. Close. It's in the microwave. I oh, picked up some chem fluid, I think. Uh, 16 years since the night nightmare of Raccoon City, the survivors are still suffering. Okay, we've got some more gunpowder. What's that? Could go this way. Oh my god, that's so dark and creepy. No. Nope. Now I'm pretty sure we've been exploring it. Oh man. Okay, right. Bosh. Shit hole. We got anything in here we can use? Machine gun ammo. How about some handgun ammo? Nice. Empty bin. Have a look through here. Close these doors. Uh, okay. 
What have we got here? This looks like um, this looks like a puzzle. I oh, got to change. Okay, have these all got to be the same? Have a... I think they've got to match. Oh, there you go. Nice. We've got some corrosive liquid. That's cool. I'm happy with that. Let's see if we can make some health. Okay, so we have some corrosive liquid now, so we should be able to open some locked doors. Just make sure there's nothing else in here. No. I hope Ethan's going to be okay. I mean, he's looks like he's having a bit of trouble with all that that stuff. Let's finish going around this way, and I know that door takes us back up, but we'll, we can check that out after. Oh! Oh! Stop moving! Ah! Dude! Oh my god, I used all my ammo. That's all my ammo gone. <laughs> okay, so looks like we've got a little save area. Nice. Uh, Special Operations Division, Director Alan Drone, is it Droney? And caretaker Mia Winters. Uh, we've already looked at this. We've been in here, I believe. Just quickly save the game. Okay, so we should be able to get we should be able to get through here now. Better have been worth it. Ah! We've got the captain's locker key. Oh, nice. Okay, I'm, I feel a bit happier now. We've got to go back up now and get the machine gun. That's cool. get we could go back up this way that just creeps me out I don't know what it is I think it's because it's all dark and like wet and the okay where's that lift okay so let's see if we can get back up this way Yeah, we should be able to get to the captain's course from here. It's just behind, behind here, isn't it? Oh! Oh! Sh Quick! 
Oh! Right, I didn't realise you have to make it detonate. Right, let's see if we can get him. Actually, can we just pick it up? Oh, he's so ugly. Right, let's, see if we can, let's try this out. Come on. Oh, he's, he's trying to be clever. I know what you're doing. Come on in. <laughs> uh, that took you, Buster, wasn't it? Oh, that's hilarious. Although I did injure myself at the same time, which is uh, not great, but... Right, let's unlock this. Where's the key? Oh, shit! Come in, big boy. Bosh! Now we're talking. Now we're talking. So let's jump down. Right, we need to make some help. Okay. So I gotta be honest, I haven't seen let's um let's have another run round because we're looking for a fuse and some cable, I believe. And um we haven't seen either of them yet, so we've either missed it or it's on that lower floor. Let's have a quick run round. It's probably it's probably they're probably gonna be on the lower floor, I reckon. But let's just be sure. This is the uh, puzzle room. That's a very easy puzzle. Nothing else in here. No. Right, let's, let's go down to the lower floor. We know there's a dude waiting down there for us. Because I've already took a, a pop at his head. Uh, before we do that though, let's just go up to the scary... Scary area. Yeah, let's have a look up here. Now I've got to be a little bit careful because I don't have any health. Ah! Oh. Cool. Oh yes, this was well worth it. Nice. Okay. Yeah, that was really worth coming up for. Okay. Let's get back into the lift shaft and then we'll we'll go down to the lower lower floor. See what shenanigans we get up to down here. Uh, where's the prompt? I see you. I'm actually looking forward to shoot this piece of shit. Come in, bitch. Oh shit, he's angry. He's angry.
Oh, nice. Oh, shit. I can hear something. It's too late for us, but at least I can let the world know what's happened here. I was on night shift sh yeah, yesterday, so I was taking a nap in the bunk room around noon. I was half asleep and I heard a kid, a little girl, laughing. Or was that my just in my head? I woke up at 7.30 and was some sort of ruckus in the passageway. Drew, one of the engineers, came in and said there was something going on out uh, down below. Maybe a riot. He looked pale in the face. He told me he was going down to check it out, but never come back. It must have been around um, uh, 10 to 8 when I heard the scream. I went to the laundry room to check and saw Clark being eaten by some sort of blackish monster. The monster turned and started coming towards me, huge shark-like teeth snapping its jaw. I just screamed like a little girl and run for it. It's a bit like me, really. Now, now I'm huddled up in the bunk room, shaking as I write this. There's a whole host of those creatures lurking in the passageways now. I can still hear screams now and then, but there's no way I'm going out there now. And that's it. I've written everything I know. Giovanni Finetti. I feel you, brother. I feel you. Dear Janet, hey, how's it going? I guess half a year or so would have passed by the time you get this letter. Life is so boring here, day after day, just the same old sea. Although there's nothing, sorry, although there is one thing that's different, this time we have set up, we have some passengers sailing with us, which hardly ever happens. It's a couple with a little girl. I think they're distant relatives of the captain. Imagine traveling on a tanker instead of a passenger ship. They must be hard up. I tried talking to the little girl earlier, and her dad shot me this nasty look. What's, what's he so worried about? Now that I think about it, the captain said he didn't even have any relatives. Maybe I'm overthinking this. I miss you, love Jim. Oh, come on. Stop giving me empty drawers. Show me some love. The thing is, this, this ship looks like it's been here for centuries. I mean, it's got shrubs and that growing, you know? That noise. Oh man, I'm not liking this at all. Plenty of these little bombs, they're pretty good actually. Just don't you could, just don't stand too near when you set them off. What's that one over there? Is that got one? Ah, see it does pay to explore thoroughly in this game. And I probably haven't oh I haven't even probably got half the stuff that's uh, hidden. Where should we go? Let's go the dark and dingy route. Oh, I can hear something. Hey. Um, I missed him. Oh no, I got him. Almost killed myself in the process though. Yeah, the problem is they pounce, which is uh... Oh, hang on. Oh, hang on. I could hear something.
Yeah, we need a knife. So I keep wasting bullets on uh, those boxes. It looks like we've explored this area before. It's just um, so that fuse. I put that fuse in there. So I do remember doing that. Save game. Okay, so So we've got the fuse, we need what do we need? We need is it a um a cable? That was it. Okay, so it looks like we've explored this area now, which is fine. Yeah, I think we're good. Hang on. Have we been in here? We've been in here originally, but I don't know. It looks like things have changed somewhat. So what does that do by putting that in there? Didn't seem to make any difference, did it? I think that fuse was originally in that, and I moved it to the door. Right, let's find a lift. Okay, we can go down here, I guess. Oh, that's... That's really helpful. Where was the lift? I can't remember. Hang on a minute, there's a room here. Yeah, that's it. Climb up. Oh, I didn't actually mean to do that. Climb back up. So we're looking for the power cable. It must be around here somewhere. I'm not sure if we've been on this floor or not. So we had this little... Yeah, I do remember. We have been here, but I don't know if we've explored it all. It's the save room. It's the TV. Okay, well let's just have a little look around. We've got a gun there. That's 4F now. We want to stay on 3F. Have a little look around. Ah, oh, we've got a lockpick now. There's that case here, isn't there? Should be able to get into this. Hey, we've got the coin. Cool. Oh, I can hear something. Oh! Oh! Did they just keep respawning or what? Hey.
Hmm. I can't get. No. Doesn't even want to tell me I can't get in there. Oh wow. Big old ship. Definitely a big ship. These toilets. I can hear the, the squelching noise. Which is usually associated with the big ugly uh, monsters. I've got some fluids over there. That'll do. Thanking you. Nothing. Nothing. I do love an empty drawer on this level. Is it? Hey! What the fuck? Hang on, hang on. Bitch. Oh! Absolute crap out of me. Oh, he's one big ugly bastard. Where the hell did he spawn from? It was from out there, wasn't it? He must have been hiding one of those cubicles. Ah, cable. Okay, so we've got the cable now. Some more fluids. Okay, well, let's, uh, let's just continue the search. I know we have the cable, but we, uh, we might as well... We're here now. We well... I still can't get out of this door. What's with this door? Right. Okay, we're going back then. Yeah, I think we got everything. Let's just go back to the uh, the lift, the elevator. Does anyone else love the sound of the gun while you're running? I've always loved that, in especially like uh, action movies as well. You know, you, you get the sound of it all kind of clinking along. I love that noise. I think we're ready. Okay, we're good. Okay, so we want to go to S2, don't we? That's where Ethan is. Creepy girl. Okay, so we can make some of that. Can we make... Okay, let me just load up the uh, handgun and just change... I'm not going to like this, am I? Oh, no, I'm not. It's fine. I'm prepared. Just ship me pants. Got a feeling the boss fight's on its way. The 
hell was that? Oh. Oh, you ugly. Wait. Hang on a minute. Are they coming down here, do you reckon? Oh, yeah, he's here. Oh! What is this, this enhanced ammo? Loves it. Oh, I'm loving it. Come on. What have we got? Okay. So you get one good shot to the face and they they go down. Oh, hang on. Here he comes. Here he comes. Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh! <laughs> oh, he's pissed. Okay, he, he took two that time. I think it's like RNG, whether you, like a, whether you actually take him out one shot. Come on, give me some stuff. Give me some stuff. Nice. Wasted a few shots there. Okay, so we've got some normal handgun ammo. There's definitely a boss fight. Look at all this stuff. nine bombs the problem with the bombs is that it'd be nice if they were kind of uh, they detonated when something was close by like a proximity mine but the uh, you have to actually do it manually which is a bit of a ball like Okay, mines, mines. Oh, no! Jesus. go. I've got another one of those coins. Let's open this up as well. Sticky bombs. Are they called sticky bombs or just bombs? I think they're just called bombs. I made I made the sticky part up. Oh you little bitch. Let's get Ethan out. Ethan. 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 
Hey, shh, shh, shh. I know, I know, I know. I'm not gonna hurt you. Hell, I never would have if I could have helped you. What do you mean? I'm no killer, son. Neither is Marguerite, nor my boy Lucas, or even Zoe here. That girl, Evelyn, she did this. What the hell is she? Now, what did she do to you? She infected us with her gift. That's what she calls it. I found her near a busted out tank in the bayou. Everything changed after that. So she infects you and then she takes control? No. Not exactly, son. She just... She forces a way into your mind, your soul. You can't fight back. You are connected to her and you can't resist the urge to different person after that. Just like Mia. So Mia sent me that message because of Evelyn. Listen, the, the girl just wants a family of her own. She's the key. All right? You find her and you stop her. Ethan. Free my family. Please. Evelyn, stay away from him. Why? He doesn't love you. I can make him love you. Don't, don't hurt him. Zoe, I told you I'm not going to hurt him. Don't you dare. So what? <laughs> Remember? Okay, so we're taking taking control of Ethan again. What the fuck are you? Oh, we've got nothing on us at all. <laughs> this is this seriously the only place to go? Oh, this is one creepy place. So not only do we have a creepy ship, we have a very, very creepy swamp. Oh, let's not forget the creepy girl that's trying to kill us as well. It's a helicopter. I 
do some whistling. Oh, this just does not sound good at all. Come all this way, I'm going to get eaten by an alligator. Uh, Abercrombie Salt Mine, South Dolby. There was a collapse in the Patterson Mine. Turan and Beckford are dead and Huxley will never walk on his own again. Um, old Man Stan was right, the ground there is too unstable. Uh, the company's not going to send us any replacements, they want us to work double shifts instead. I can't wait to get back to the old country. Rough, man. Are they, uh, are they watching us from the helicopter? Alpha One, this is Bravo One. Do you read? This is Alpha One. Report. Did you find anything? A thorough search of the Baker property revealed zero survivors. Repeat, zero survivors. We did find evidence of a skirmish. Evelyn? Negative. However, we did find several encrypted messages from the Baker's son, Lucas, to an unknown third party. You can probably guess who that was. That's just great. We've had reports using the abandoned mine south of the property. I'm gonna go have a look. Roger that. We'll meet you at those coordinates. If you encounter Evelyn, orders are shoot to kill. Repeat, shoot to kill. Well, that wraps up that video. If you want to see more, then check out the channel. Until next time, guys. See ya.